What is reality? Well, it all depends on your perception, actually. Let us take sound, light, touch, smell, taste. Without the proper instruments to perceive of such things, we would say all these are unreal. They do not exist. The simple essence of reality explained is when we can sense it in some way, either through our bodies or through an external instrument. Take a radio wave, for example. Of course, we all know it exists because we grew up with it in our lifetime. However, had we lived in the 1700s, we would not even conceive of such a thing, except in our imagination. The invisible energy can be modulated to the spoken word and then further recombined to enable us to experience visually, in a video experience, anything either the instant it happens or many years ago, even before we were born. Now isn't that a miracle beyond imagination to someone who lived so long ago? Radar, radiology. With this we can see the Earth's weather in many ways or inside the human being's body, even the magnetic patterns of thoughts inside our brain. Further, we can heat our food or look beyond the stars through the Hubble telescope. Actually, the Hubble photographs three different wavelengths. By varying the wavelengths, we get different views of the same object. The world is any way you want to view it, much as in the wavelength filters built inside that Hubble telescope. Our world looks entirely different through an electron microscope or perhaps a thermal imaging device. Well, the point of this whole discourse is that there are many aspects and views of the world beyond our limited ordinary perceptions. These provide evidence of reality that exists beyond the senses. So now let's apply that stance to metaphysics and you get some rather imaginative possibilities, don't we? This describes my curiosities with many of the materials placed on this web page.